Thank you for listening again, or for the first time, or for the last time. We share this moment. Hey, it's Fiction Riot. Today we have Sobek and Anubis in Asothoth. Who cares about that asshole? All right, chapter 37. And okay, everybody, I'm going on vacation on the 1st of July, so I'm either gonna end the fic or update it in a week. Thanks. Oh, yeah, and perhaps stop flaming the story. Uh, Raven, thanks for the help. See ya, girl. After vocation. X, 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 whatever. Go. Darko's point of view. LOL. Vampire and I chain Hagrid to the Hagrid. floor. <laughs> Hair kid. <laughs> to the floor. Oh, me fucking Satan, 1-1. One, one. Inubi said she was so hot. Maybe I could use amnesia potion to make Satan fall in love with me faster, exclamation mark one. But you are so sexy and wonderful and anyway, Tata. What the fuck is Tata? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? So vampire, why would you need it? To make everything go faster, lol, said Enemy. But you won't have to do it with him or anything, will you? I asked jealously. OMFG, you guys are so scary, said Brittany, a fucking prick. <laughs> Brittany's just there. <laughs> <laughs> so she can be a fucking prep. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, said Willow. Okay, well, anyway, let's go to Professor Trevor Roy's room. Trevor Roy! Yeah! Draco, Ebony, and I went to. Wait. Ebony. Wait, I thought this was from Draco's point of view. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Draco, Ebery, and I went to Professor Sid Sidiator Sidiator's room, but Professor Sidiator wasn't there. Well, that's because you went to Professor Sidiator's room, Draco. Instead, Tom Rid was Tom Rid. Oh, hi, fuckers! He said, <laughs> "Those are not in quotations." Listen. I got you some cool new cloves. Whoa, uh, shit! <laughs> uh, wait, are, are they talking about, like, c cloves cloves? Like, fucking... <laughs> like, I took out the cloves <laughs> from the bag. It was a gothic black le leather miniskirt that said 666 on the back. On the back. Duh back. Black stilton boots, boots made out of cheese. <laughs> Blood red fishnets <laughs> and a black corset. Oh, and OMG fangs! Wait, is it back to enemy? <laughs> Was it ever Draco? <laughs> this is a Draco's point of view. Lol. <laughs> Flashback time. This is so bad. Oh my god. Alright, alright. Draco, you have to have more energy. Wait, me? OMG, fangs! I said hugging him in a hugging him in a gothic way. You what? Hug in a gothic way. <laughs> hold on, hold on. You gotta, you gotta wear a cape. You gotta wear a cape. I took duck clothes in the bag. Okay, Professor Sinister isn't here. Her, her. What the fuck should we do? Said Draco. Suddenly, he locked up the sign on the black wall. Oh yeah, my but... fucking Satan! I screamed as I read it. On it, oh. it on it said every professor, everyone, Professor Sinister is away. She is too gothic, and she is an Azkaban now. Wait, what? No, Azkaban. You can arrest people for being gothic. <laughs> Azkaban. Uh, classes shall be shall be taught, taught by Double Dork, who is back. But he shall not be principal for now. Sincerely, Professor Rumbridge. OMFG111, I shouted, Arngurly. <laughs> How can they do that? 1-1. One, one. Suddenly, Dumbly Door came. What the hell are you do dong in my office? <laughs> Suddenly, Dumbly Door came. What the hell are you dong in my office? He began to shoot angrily. <laughs> Suddenly, I saw Marty McFly's black time machine. Why did Marty Mc... Why is Marty McFly in this again? Was he in this before? Yes. Yes. <laughs> I jumped seductively into it, leaving Draco a vampire. Suddenly, I was back in Tim. I turned around. It was Professor Slutborn's Ephes. 
I sneaked around. <laughs> Suddenly, I saw the amnesia potion on his desk. It was black with blood red pentagrams in it. Why? <laughs> Dude, are there's just like fucking pentagram shavings <laughs> yeah. inside the fucking potion. It was the shape of a cross. Pure I put it in my abstract. pocket. Suddenly the door opened. It was Professor Slutgord! <laughs> <laughs> OMG, what are you doing, Fooker? He shouted angrily. I don't know what the fuck you're doing! I shouted angrily! <laughs> oh, sorry. I was just looking around because I thought it was class. You said, finally hoping you could <laughs> see the... Potion in your pocket? <laughs> when did he turn to second person? What the fuck? <laughs> Wait, can we go back? Oh, OMG, what are you doing, Fuker? He shouted angrily. I don't know what the fuck you are doing! I shouted <laughs> So I turned to second person now, so that's fine. This is fine. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh. Okay. <laughs> you went to the you con man. now. <laughs> you went to the con man room. After putting on my clothes. What? what? Silas, Samaro, and Snap were practicing vampire vam vampires will never hurt you by MCR. Oh hi you guys, I said seductively. Where's Satan? Oh he's coming. That spelled like sex cum. What the cum. fuck? What <laughs> the fuck? BTW, you can call me Hattie ha you can call me ha ha Hades now. Suddenly Satan came. He was wearing a smexy black leather Jackson, <laughs> black conga <laughs> shoes, a slipknot t-shirt, and a black tie. Conga okay, shoes. I will see you guys at the concert, I said, and then I went with to say with Hold Satan. on, I have a political humor joke. <laughs> Congress shoes, they're always yelling at each other. Uh, and they never get anything done. Hey, I had a joke that I came up with in my sleep, but I don't remember. Oh, oh, uh, TV. It was oh, I thought that was a TV. joke. It was a TV joke. A joke about a television. Chapter 38. <laughs> and what does everyone think if I end a story and then I add some more to it after vocation? Oh yeah, Asin's prep stoop flaming. If you need to like that story, then take my quiz. Okay, then you will see if you're gothic or not. One, 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 one. X, 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 six, 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 six. There's four sixes. <laughs> nice fucking job, idiot. <laughs> Satan and I walked to his car. It was a black car with pentagrams all over it. On the license plate said 666, just like Lick Draco's car. I went in it seductively. Satan started to drive it. <clears throat> I'm sorry, I'm choking. <clears throat> We talked about Satanism, walls, he was named after Satan, cutting, music, and being gothic. Oh my Satan, Gerard is so fucking hot, 1-1. One, one. Volksamort agree- What the fuck, when did he get there? <laughs> no, it's, uh, it's, yeah, he, Satan is Voldemort. Right? Really? Yeah. What the, why would you switch between Satan and Voldemort? As uh, yeah, he smokes wait. some weed. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Dipper. Wanna smoke some weed? Let's light up this road, bro. <laughs> Let's get lit. <laughs> Who just starts out smoking with? Oh my, Satan Gerard is so hot. Why is he allowed at Hogwarts? He's Voldemort. What the fuck? I don't that know. It's in the past when he goes to Hogwarts. But his name is Tom Riddle, so I don't know why it's named Voldemort. Cause bi guys are hot, they are so sensitive, I love them, lol, goes fucks a bi guy. Lol, well, I totally <laughs> decided not to com commit suicide when I heard Helena. I said in a flirty voice. Hey! Hey Satan, I almost <laughs> do you know the cure for when people are addicted to... Volksamort serum? Volksamort serum. <laughs> well... He thought, I think you have to drink vampire blood. What suddenly, suddenly Volksamort parked the car behind a black movie theater. Satan Why are and I. Black? Satan and I walked outside. We went into the movie theater t tether. tether where we were showing The Exorcist. In, a, in it, a boy and a girl were doing it. Suddenly, a serial killer came. Lol. Whoa. Satan and I laughed at the blood because we're saddest. 
Well, Satan and was while well, Satan was watching the movie, I had an idea. I took Murder. Satan's b b gothic black nightmare before Christmas cigar sexily from his pocket, this is and the we 50s. put some. <laughs> we put some amnesia potion in it. I put it black back in his black Emil. What the fuck? Is a nightmare bag. before Christmas cigar. And how, why <laughs> would you take it sexily if you're trying to be like secret about it? How do you take a cigar sexily? Satan why turned, would you put? Satan, why would you put the, po the potion, the poison on it? Satan turned around and started to smoke it. Black cows with wet, with red pentagrams. In, in, in them started oh in them okay that's what she meant to say in them started to fly around everywhere omg one more one satan said jumping up i guessed i guessed because i was afraid he had noticed enemy guess what i knew that the amnesia had worked amnesia potion has not been invented yet so it will not work he said what Too bad you <laughs> <What? laughs> <laughs> what? Cole, I raised my eyes suggestingly, and then he took off my clothes essentially oh. every time to make out. I took off his shit. He had a six pack. It was just oh. like Jester, like Gerard Way. We French. French. Excuse me, but you are going to have to leave. She needed a lady behind us, and she was a prep. <laughs> Fuck, Fuck you. you. One one. I said <laughs> suddenly. I attacked her, sucking all her blood. Oh, shit. No! She screamed. All the all other preps in the theater <laughs> screamed, but everyone else crapped because Satan and I look so cute together. Murder, Satan and yeah! I started to walk outside. Zom, how did you do that? Voldemort asked in a turned on voice. Well, I murdered Zom. <laughs> a turned on voice is. How did you do that? Uh, no, a turned on voice is like. So, I'm. Uh, <laughs> How did you do that? I'm a vampire, I said as we went to the car. Seriously? He gasped. Yeah, seriously, I said, drinking some beer. <laughs> Out of oh. nowhere, from thin air. Satan started to drive the car. I smelled happily. It's too bad we didn't get to see the rest of the movie, don't you think? Yeah, I said as we, as we kissed her. <laughs> passively. <laughs> Satan parked in a black driveway next to the place where Draco... And I had watched GC for the first time. We went inside where Marilyn Mason was playing and started to mosh, lol. Anti people, now we've gone too far. Joe's Christ Superstar! Screamed Marilyn on the stage. We did the devil fingers. I started to dance really close what to Satan. Fuck is the devil fingers? <laughs> he was so schmexy. Uh, he looked at me all emo with his gothic red eyes, and he looked exactly like Michael Way. Mikey Way. Mikey Way. I almost got an orgasm. Orgasm. <laughs> orgasm. <laughs> Suddenly, Marilyn, Mar Marilyn Mason stopped singing. I would like to present X Black T X. He said. Oh, I ran on stage. Uh, I ran on stage. Lu Lucian, Samara, Snap, and Hades were there. They started to play their installments. <laughs> I sang on stag. I got on stag. Well, if you wanted, honestly, that's all you had to say. Uh, if you wanted, honest, okay, f if, if you wanted honesty, that's all you had to say. I sang, I don't own the lyrics to that song. My, vo yeah. my voice sounded like a pentagram between <laughs> Amy Lee and what? a girl version of Gerard Ward. What? <laughs> Everyone clapped. <laughs> Satan got an Eric Tashin. I'm not okay! I sang fiddly. Suddenly, Lucian started to play the song wrong by mistake. OMFG! Yielded James. What the fuck? Whoops, I'm sorry, said Lucian. You Lucian, why are you fucking asshole? Asshole, <laughs> James shouted angrily. You guys are such preps, 1 1, Snap said. Come, like C U M, on. It was a mistake. Yeah, it's not his fault, 1 1, said Sirius. No, he ruined the fucking song, yelled Samaro. <laughs> or you could just keep going and, like, you guys entertain stop, the audience. <laughs> one, one. I sh 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 toed angrily, but it was too late. They all began to fight. Suddenly, Samaro took out his knife. Owen, it's l he played this song wrong, and you guys are gonna fucking kill each other, really? <laughs> OMFG, no, one, one, shouted Lucan, but it was too late. James tried to shoot off his... What the fuck? <laughs> Tried to shoot off his arm. And then... Hold on, drummer. 
I jump sexily in front of the bullet. Oh! Okay, how do you do that? Se <laughs> <laughs> no, one one yielded everyone. But it was too late. Suddenly everything went black. Chapter 39. I am a trolling genius, lols. Oh, this is the troll chapter. There's a chat. Okay, guys, if you don't know, there was a chapter written in My Immortal where a tr where someone hacked into Tara's account and wrote an entire chapter as a troll, and she later deleted it. I, I think that's how it goes. Either that, or someone just like there's a missing chapter. They just decided to write one and toss it in there. But I think it's the it's the first one. I'm a little rusty in my My Immortal knowledge, honestly. <laughs> Yeah, it's been a while since I studied my ancient tomes of My Immortal. <laughs> <laughs> the ancient and secret history of My Immortal. Uh, the Mayan calendar did not foretell... My Immortal. <laughs> it, it foretold My Immortal, basically. It, it foretold, like, 2012 was the year that <clears throat> Terra Way was going to turn into My Immortal, so... Uh, disclaimer, I do not own the HP series. Oh, this is actually... You can actually read this. I do not own the HP series, and I am not the real XXX Bloody Wrist 666XXX. And I am extremely immature, pathetic idiot girl I know. Out of boredom, I crack this girl's passy for fun. Oh, we're back to this shit. <laughs> and it took less than eight minutes to do it, too. And we'll probably get in a shitload of trouble, which I probably deserve because I'm being a troll right now. Meh. And I present to you my crappy part in this story, and take note, I haven't even finished reading this fic yet, but instead skip over to Skim Chapter 38, Flame, Laugh, Do Whatever You Want, Preps. <laughs> I, the American retail-wearing British vampire Sue, coughed up blood. Satan kneeled down beside me. No, Don't die! I gave him a rueful so uh, smile. I'm sorry. This is actually not that bad. It's because it's written by someone else. Yeah, but it, I mean, it's still shitty, but it's not that bad. <laughs> it's so much fucking bad. I can read it's it. because you can't fake that. True. It's, it's literally impossible for you to fake being that bad. I gave him a rueful smile. I'm sorry. It's something I had to do to fulfill my duty as a noble gothic Mary Sue. They spelled gothic right. Yeah. The trolls spelled gothic right. Go, go troll. Satan sobbed. I love you, Ebony. I love you too. <laughs> they spelled too like T W O. I love you too. I'll, I'll see you in hell. I mumbled. <laughs> I'll see. I'll see you in hell. Already like, finding my cold surroundings cold. fading to black. But Luddy Mary Smith suddenly popped out into the room for no apparent reason. She frowned when she realized the room was oddly quiet, but at the sight of Ebony's lifeless body, she screamed. Her face became pale with horror. She screamed for the healers, Dumbledore, McGoogle, <laughs> McGoogle, and every yeah. single gothic person she could think of. Suddenly, a glow started to surround the body of Ebony. Everyone stared in shock. Her body started to lift ever so slowly, Is and then like we went Potter? to, and then to everyone's shock, it started to incinerate. Oh, what? No, it's not then. <laughs> incinerate. I don't. I don't want to read this shit anymore. This okay, is, I got it. So I got it. I, I'll take it over. Uh, where are you? It started to incinerate. Started to incinerate. Oh wait, hang on. Let me capture the picture of the. Because I'm going to put them... It's not just... Whatever. I don't care anymore. Uh, suddenly a glow started to surround the body of Anna Ebony. Everyone stared in shock. Her body started to lift ever so slowly. And then to everyone's shock, it started to incinerate. When everyone realized what ha was happening, they rushed over to try and rescue the body. But it was too late. The Sioux became nothing more than a pile of ashes. A loud resounding b of ever everyone b bellowing no filled the room. A white flash of white light from the ashes then started to bounce around the room. Everyone cowered in fear and were temporarily blinded. When it was all over, things changed. All the silly goth clothes dropped from everyone's bodies. Oh, I will refuse to explain how any uh, how the hell that happened, and in their place clothes the characters would normally wear in canon appeared on their bodies. When everyone got over the shock of becoming free of the gothic power, everybody cheered. Everyone started singing "Ding Dong, the Sioux is dead." Well, that is until all the HP characters realized their true implications of becoming more canon-like again. 
All the characters who were supposed to be dead fell to the floor, their bodies cold and lifeless. Harry and Voldemort started dueling. On the left side of the two, the battle of the light side and the dark side were reaching climax, and because of the replacement author also likes to screw around with canon, Draco and Hermione fled the scene and got married. Meanwhile, oh, down in hell, Ebony shed a single tear because of her tr current situation, a situation that would that would live on for all eternity, or at least until the end of fanfiction time. She lost it all, but she knew she had to remain strong. Nothing would ever break her down. She looked down over her pale body and frowned. Where are my emo clothes? She asked herself in confusion. And then it occurred to her. Uh, for her shirt, clothes. she was wearing a bright pink polo with a little seagull on the right. Right or the left? I can't remember. Side. Below that, she was wearing a denim miniskirt with the destroyed look on it. Pairing underneath that skirt, shirt, skirt were leggings with a little moose at the bottom, and then Ebony realized, on her shoulder, she was carrying a pretty bag with an eagle on it that said, Live your life, written all over the bag. Ebony su suppressed the urge to scream. Here, she was decked out in clothes, prepped to the extreme, wearing, prepped stuff, to the extreme. <laughs> wearing <laughs> stuff from Abercrombie and Fitch, American Eagle, and Hollister. Panicked, Enneby hastily tried to take off the Hollister polo, but underneath it there was another Hollister polo underneath. Ebony frowned, looking under her shirt. All she saw was a bra underneath. Dare I point out, it's from the airy line available at American Eagle. Ebony tried to remove the shirt again, but to her frustration there was yet another polo to replace it. This is unlogical! It does not make any sense! Of Ebony bell bellowed out into the air. <clears throat> she failed to see the irony in her statement. How hypocritical her words were, seeing as she was practically calling the kettle black here. <laughs> Ebony slit her wrist and bubbled to herself. Oh my god. <laughs> End of crap pick. And Oh yeah, if you want to see the original content, this trick had planned for the chapter, I accessed it through the document manager thingy, which I copied and pasted so you can read it here. And STF, you preps, get a lift. One, 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 you suck. Oh, and from now on, I'll be on vacation in England until like August, so I won't be able to update for the while. Alls, fangs to everyone who revoiled except for preps who flammed. Fuck you, MCR rules 666. One, one, one. Okay, uh, Thoth, come over. <coughs> what you got? <coughs> I, woke up, I woke up in the Norse's office on a special like, gothic coffin. He's like tiring me to read this shit. It is. Herigrid was in a de bed opposite <laughs> me in a coma because Vampire and Draco had bet him up. Mr. Norris was cleaning the room. Oh, hi, oh, my Satan, what happened? I screamed. Oh, oh, my Satan, what happened? I screamed. Suddenly, Volksmore came. He looked less mean than usual. Get the fuck out, you fucking bastard, I yielded. Thou hath not killed the vampire. Oh, yeah. Didn't they just have sex? No, this is future Volksmore. Thou hath not killed the vampire yet, he said angrily. Suddenly, he started to cry tears of blood, all selective. What? <laughs> Look smart. OMFG, what's wrong, Ash? She just said, get out of here, you bastard. <laughs> Suddenly, Lucian, Professor Sinister, and Sirius came. Bloody Mary and Vampire were with them. Everyone was holding black boxes. Volksamort disappeared. OMFG, Enemy, you're alive, <laughs> screamed Vampire. I hugged him and Bloody Mary. What the fuck happened, I asked him. Oh, my Satan. Am I, like, dead now? I gasped. Enemy, you were almost shot, said Sirius. But the bullet... But the ballet, the but the ballet could not kill you, <laughs> since you were formed another time. What? But fangs anyway," said Lucian, Lucian, holding out his arm. I gasped. He had two arms. OMFG! I can't believe vampires. <laughs> Wait, why is it surprising that he had two arms? <laughs> <laughs> I know. She says that before. She says that earlier, and it's like, what are you talking about? OMG, I can't believe Vampire's dad shot you, I guess. Well, to be honest, Snap was possessed by Snap back then, said James. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Snap was possessed by Snap back then. Oh my god. No yeah, he was a spy, Sirius said sadly. He was really a death dealer. <laughs> and he was such a fucking poser, 211, said Lucian. He didn't even really know who GC were until I told... This is like... So long ago, how did... This was 2006, I think. No, but like, in the past, how oh, is fucking... This is like the 1950s. GC around. Well, anyway, everyone tarted to give me presents. I was opening a black box with red 666s. Six there was a DVD of Corpse Bride in it. Uh, on it when I... Wait, red 666s six on it when I gassed. <laughs> Mr. Norris 
looked up angrily because he hated goth. Goths. Why does everyone hate goth so much? Hey, has anyone... A is, it new it, one. is it because the author wants to be part of a subculture that's hated, but she didn't really find a subculture that's hated? So yeah. She just kind of was like, well, I'm just gonna be like, she could pretend to be anything else. Yeah. <laughs> she's like, oh, everybody oppresses the goths. And then she's like talking to her friend. I'm a goth. And they're like, oh, that's cool. She's like, gosh dang it. I need drama. Hey, Did, uh, don't tolerate me. And new one. Yeah. Fucking seen Draco ass gothically. Gothic How do you ask? Hey, has anyone fucking seen Draco? <laughs> no, Draco told me he would be watching Hose of Wax. Hose of Wax? <laughs> what? What's House of Wax? It's Hose of Wax. Oh, what is Hose of Wax? I don't hey, know. House of Wax. Said Professor Trevor Lee. He doesn't know that you're better. Anyway, Den Norse said you could get up. Come like C U M on one. I got up suicidally. Stabbing yourself rightly. What the fuck? Lucian, serious and Professor Sinister left. I was wearing a black leather knit gun. Knit gun. <laughs> under that, uh, under that, I had a sexy black leather bra trimmed with black lace. Wouldn't that be uncomfortable? Like. A leather bra? Of course bra. it would be! It's leather against your bare skin! And a matching thong that said gothic girl on the butt. Yeah! Does she know how a thong works? And sexy fishnets that had... Well, it says gothic girl really small. <laughs> <laughs> what she worry about? What if it was like, in Comic Sans, like, 8 font gothic girl? Not even 8 font, like, microscopic. Yeah, you, like... you had to, like, get a microscope and, like... Yeah. Well, she's just wearing the thong backwards. <laughs> <laughs> that would be uncomfortable. Yeah. And sexy fishnets that kind hooked onto my thong. If you don't get the idea, message me, I'll tell you. I put on a black fishnet top under a black MCR t-shirt, a black leather mini... <laughs> <laughs> Fucking sign... It's a fucking uh, asshole. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, lost that. Um, where was I? And this shitty fucking piece of trash. <laughs> and Congress shoes. I left the hospital's wings with Bloody Mary, Bo have wings. Ludi Mary, yeah. Willow, and Vampire. OMFG! Let's uh, celebrate, Gast. Wait, who does she like? Does she like Vampire or does she like fucking. Draco. She likes both of them. The, the she likes both triangle. of them. It's a love triangle. It's also a love, love. triangle because vampire and Draco are in love too. What? Because they're bisexual guys. Because bisexual guys are so hot. X, X, X. Because because they're so sensitive and I like that. And I'm gonna fuck a bi guy. <laughs> yeah, but at the beginning, at the beginning, at the beginning of the story, this is this is no joke. She was like. I'm Raven, or no, not, I'm Enemy and I'm bi. Raven is my best girlfriend. Ew, not like that. Gross. <laughs> oh my god. Oh what? Oh my god. Oh my god. I can testify directly to that people who like more than one gender at a time are really sensitive. <laughs> you. Just don't even... <laughs> I'm not sensitive. <laughs> yeah, I have a heart of stone. OMFG, let's celebrate, gas ga really gasped Willow. OMFG, let's celebrate! No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> OMFG, let's celebrate! No, she's like, it's, it's like the Five Nights at Freddy's death games. I'm gonna like write a this. fanfic, and I'm just gonna, after I'm finished, <gasps> replace every time I say said with chortled. <laughs> just be like, <laughs> So we can go layer, We can go see House of Wax with Draco, chortled vampire. <laughs> Let's go listen to GC and cut ourselves. 66611 said Hermione. <laughs> what the fuck? Wait, no, it's Bloody Mary. Yeah, Bloody Mary. Mary. Why no, she said Hermione. What? Her needs to mind her own business. I'm serious, Hermione. Her needs to mind her own business. Her 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 Hermione. Hermione. <laughs> It's spelled Hermoin. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah. Hermoin. We opened a con men room door sexily. All of them opened it sexily <laughs> at the same time. 
<laughs> All of them just put their fucking hands on the doorknob. Yeah, sit on the bed, it's much more comfortable. And then... Wait, I have to do this sexily. Uh, okay. And then... Whoa. I gasped. Draco was there doing it with Snap. One, 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 what? one, one, one. What? He was wearing a black T-shirt with six, six, six on the front and baggy jeans. You fucking prep. We all yelled angrily. <laughs> yeah, you betrayed us. They're just fucking in the middle of the fucking. <laughs> <laughs> they're just like they're not even telling them to stop. You're just like you're disgusting. Keep yeah. going. A teacher <laughs> in the fucking middle of the con room. Um. Yeah, you betrayed us, shouted Vampire angrily as he took out his black gun. Why does she need to add fucking black to everything? Everything We went black. to a black movie theater. We got inside Vampire's black car. Hold on. Black is like the default color for all the things she says are black, too. Wait, Wait a minute. You're having sex with somebody? Time to die! <laughs> Why did you pick up a gun? Again? No, you don't understand, one! Screamed Draco sadly. No, you don't understand! One. <laughs> one! As he took out... As he took his thingy out of Snape... Oh, so, he so they're just... They have both their dicks. <laughs> Let me just get this straight so we're 100% clear. They just have both their penises out. Okay. So they have both their penises out and they're sticking them inside of each other. I just want to make that perfectly clear that that's what she's insinuating right now. It's really weird. <laughs> no. No, you don't understand, screamed Draco sadly, as he took his thingy out of snakes. <laughs> Wait. No. <laughs> yeah. No, they're sticking their dicks inside of each other's dicks. <laughs> no shit, you fucking suck, you just, trippy bastard. Maybe he was just having sex with a snake. <laughs> no, <laughs> Said Willow, trying to attack him. Oh, you rock, girl one. I ran suicidally to my room and sexually took a steak out. Wait, is it a steak? Or oh, like a steak. <laughs> <laughs> Is like it a, supposed to be spelled S T A K E? Yeah. Yes. It's spelled like steak, like the fucking meat. <laughs> Enemy no, screamed Draco, but it was too late. I had slit my wrists with it. Suddenly, everything went black again. <laughs> Why? Why you kids are dead? With she a give, steak? She gave herself a bunch of splinters. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> Abby, no. <laughs> I have to fucking read this. I actually have to read this. I have to read this shitty thing. I'm gonna die because of stupid fan <laughs> Sincerely, an Anne, an author who will silently not reveal her identity because she's a coward. <laughs> AKA just a troll with rocks for brains. Chapter 40. <laughs> LOL. Someone has taken my account over. The idiot's note. Well, this is in the dock area. Might as well let the whole world see what the real Tara wanted to show us. Have a nice day. And STFU preps, get a lift. 111, you suck. 11. Oh, what and did she four. Write that? Is, it a, is it a draft? <laughs> 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 And from now on, I'll be, or no, and from now on, I'll be in vocation in England until, like, this is the same exact thing. Yep. Until, like, August, so I won't be able to update for a while, lols. Thanks to everyone who reviled Expecta Preps who flemmed fuck you, fuck you, MCR rule 666111. XXX666XXX. X, 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 X. I woke up in the Norse nurse's office on a special gothic coffin. <laughs> what the fuck? I can't. I can't. You can. You have to. Hairgrid was in Wait, the. No, this, this is just the same. Hairgrid was in the bed opposite me. This is the same thing. Yeah, it is. It just is. skip to where it's not the same thing anymore. 
Because this happened last time. <laughs> uh, Thoth, remember this happened? Or we weren't oh, there for it, but like the other guys okay, before us freaking ended uh, up with the same exact um, thing repeated. Okay. Like <laughs> this is the last line from the thing, which is repeated again because this thing is so fucking shitty. <laughs> and it'd be no one 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 screamed Draco, but it was too late. <coughs> I had slit my wrists with it. Suddenly everything went black again. Idiot's note. Ugh, I know, terrible. But then again, this would be wouldn't be called the worst fanfic ever if not for the fact that the writing standards meet the level of a day old fetus. Nice. Dang. Nice. That was cold. Chapter forty one. Like and a day old fetus. To everyone who keeps flimmin' dis get slip. Get slip. What, get what, slip. What does that mean? <laughs> Get to slip, everyone, get this, I think I think this is what she means. To everyone who keeps flaming, who keeps flaming this, get a life. Oh. But it's, to everyone who keeps flaming this, get slip. Get slip. I bet you probably. Get slip quick. We didn't laugh. To everyone who keeps flaming this gets the lift. I bet you pro proly didn't know who jerk ways. You're probably all preps and posers. N no way. Someone hacked into me account in November and they put up my last chapter. But now there is a new one. I'm sorry for not updating. Go for a while, but I've been really busy. I'm trying to finish the story before the new movie comes, KUMZ, out. Yeah. I'm going on vacation <coughs> for yeah. a yeah. month, and I won't be back until about two weeks. OMFG, Draco is so hot in all the pics for the new movie, 111. I wanted them to put a cameo by Gerard Way, lol. He has. He who's played Draco. Can I the rest of your bare finger? If you flame, I'll slit m sure. slit my wrists. I put one my mouth one. On it. Raven, you down. rock girl. Have fun in England. I n g l a n d. Wait, is <laughs> slitting your wrists a fun uh, fun time activity for goths? I mean, I thought that was already established uh, the past yeah. forty chapters. Like, <laughs> <laughs> they like it apparently. Hey I guys, mean, let's go slit our wrists. It's like a Hey, we're gonna stop it there. This is like tiring me out. Like, it I is, need a nap. I'm, yeah, I'm tired now, so oh, anyway. Bye, guys.